and welcome to another review from Colour with Claire. Today I'm reviewing the Colour Pocket. Now what exactly is this mysterious box I hear you ask? Well, it's a portable colouring storage system that's designed to be taken out with you wherever you go for a bit of on the spot colouring when you find yourself waiting at the doctors or sat on the train, anywhere you've got a bit of spare time and you want to scratch that colouring itch. Now before I continue, this is only available to buy in the US at this current time, but worldwide shipping is on the agenda so I'll keep you updated and let you know when that happens. So it comes in two different types, this stunning wooden case which is ideal for adult colourists as it's got more of a professional look to it and then there's the different coloured plastic variety which is marketed more towards children. I'll be reviewing those in a future video so that you can see all the differences but for now today we're looking at this premium wooden version. This is precision machined from solid American oak and then hand sanded and stained by skilled craftsmen in Minnesota, USA. So it really is a cut above in terms of build quality and materials. Put it this way, it's built to last. It feels almost like a butcher's block that you'd buy from a top department store, though thankfully it's nowhere near as heavy. It does have some weight to it, as you can imagine being crafted from solid wood, but it's certainly more than light enough to carry around in your backpack or tote. So as I mentioned, the Colour Pocket is designed to encapsulate everything you need to colour all in one handy compact place. The lid is fixed by strong magnets at either side to keep all your supplies safe. And the first thing you see on opening is this tray of pencils. They're all double sided for efficiency, so you're getting 24 colours out of 12 pencils. And just here, tucked away, is a sharpener in its own little recess. Just pop that back. Now, you can lift out the tray, lift out the fully wooden tray, it's all wooden, and here are your deck of colouring cards. Now, every colour pocket comes with a starter deck of 12 cards, which can be sent as postcards with the info on the back. There are loads of different deck designs available to buy, from florals and stained glass style cats, to seaside scenes and modernist Mondrian. They also have a blank set that you can buy if you're an artist who wants to use this kit as a portable art station whereby you could draw and colour your own designs. Now these 4x6 cards are designed to fit into the recess on top of the colour pocket. So their corners just slot into these gaps at the edge and that keeps it from sliding around. So not only do you have the storage case and all the materials you need to colour, it also doubles up as a desk with a hard flat surface for you to lean on as you colour. Now the fantastic thing about this is that once you've gone through all of the different colour pocket decks and you need more illustrations to colour, you can make the refills yourself. So you can see here that I've printed out some um, illustrations from all of my favourite artists, so Mario Le Budek, Jasmine Beckett Griffiths, Hannah Lynn etc. onto cardstock, I scaled them and cut them down to size and they're a perfect fit now for the colour pocket. So you don't have to worry about running out of designs because it's so easy to create your own cards out of any PDFs or digital art that you've bought online. Similarly, if you wanted to carry different pencils to the ones that come with your colour pocket, you can do that as well. For example, you can put polychromos in here, you can put Prismacolor, you could put watercolour pencils so that you can do a bit of painting when you're out and about. It's such a versatile product that you can really personalise it to fit your colouring needs and preferences. So all the decks and the pencils included can be bought separately to the Colour Pocket, each costing $10, so they're really cheap to refill. And every time you purchase a new deck, the artist that designed them gets paid, so it's really supportive of the artist as well. Now here's a card that I coloured from the starter deck, using the pencils that are included in the Colour Pocket. Now even though these are certainly not artist quality pencils, you can see how smoothly the colour laid down to get gradients and blends, and how vibrant the colours are, so they're of a decent standard, they're not the very cheap scratchy kind with no pigment at all to speak of. I also added some stickles to the dragonfly wings to give them some extra pizzazz, so this is ready to be sent as a postcard to a friend or even framed if you wanted to. The standard 4x6 size makes it really easy to find a beautiful frame for them. So how much does a colour pocket cost? Well, I'm not going to beat around the bush. This wooden version is a superior quality colour in supply that I think is going to outlive me, to be honest. So you have to expect that it's not going to be a $5 item. 
A wooden colour pocket with everything you see here included is currently priced at $66, which is around £50. And having held one of these in my hands, I'm convinced that this is a very reasonable price for such quality. And when you couple that with the fact that you can make as many of your own colouring cards as you like and put any different types of pencils in here, it is an investment that you're going to get your money's worth out of very, very quickly. Particularly if you do a lot of travelling or colouring uh, and, uh, on your commute to work. Don't forget that the wooden version is um, $66, but if that's out of your price range at this time, you can always go for the plastic type, which is $30, and it has all of the same things included. At this moment in time, there's a 48 hour flash sale on the Colour Pocket website, so you can get the plastic version for just shy of $20. So hop over there now if you want to snap one up. I really hope that you've enjoyed looking at this beautiful product today. Please let me know in the comments what you think of it. And don't forget to check the description for the link to go and get one for yourself. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you soon on Colour with Claire.